Hey everyone, this is an Alcohol Free Life channel where we learn to live sober one day at a time. If you could take a second, can you please hit that subscribe button and don't forget to smash that like button. I'd really appreciate it. My name is Terry G and let's get to the video. But before we start the video, I just want to give a shout out to Mark D. He's coming up to one year of continuous sobriety. Congratulations, Mark. What a go, man. What a go. I know what that means to be sober for that first year. What an accomplishment. What an accomplishment. Your life, Mark, will do nothing but improve. It really will. If we stay sober, we get off the drugs, we take it one day at a time, life just gets better. It really does. And Mark, thanks a lot for sharing that on my in the comments on my YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. I'm glad you're doing really well. What a go. What this video is about is things that I did under the influence of alcohol and that's what this video is about. I want to point out some things that I was willing to do, but if somebody walked up to me and said, you know, Terry, you're an alcoholic and a drug addict and you got to clean up your life. I'd be like cursing them. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? I'm an alcoholic. What are you talking about? I'm a drug addict. You don't know. You don't know where I come from. You don't know my problems. And I just want to start off by saying also that drinking was fun at one time. It just, it didn't go to shit overnight. I worked hard at it. I really did. I worked hard at becoming a really good active alcoholic and drug addict. You know, I was willing to give up my freedom, going to jail for uttering death threats, assault, those sort of things. I got violent when I drank. I fought when I drank. I got raged when I drank. And I'll tell you something, people don't like that. The cops come, they put the cuffs on you. They put you in the slammer. I was willing to give up good job, good career opportunities because of drinking. I was a sous chef in the Hall of the Inns when the Hall of the Inns had a big chain. We're talking in the 80s, in the late 80s. I was a sous chef at 22, a promising career. Alcohol took that away from me. But I knew I was a big drinker. I was willing to be abusive to my partners. I was willing to ruin my credit rating. I remember one time I went down in an apartment I was renting, went down the underground parking lot and I saw my car being repoled. I was willing to do that, but I'd go out drinking again. I was willing not to see my children because I drank. I was willing to do all that in order to keep the madness going, to keep the craziness going. I was homeless. I was unemployable. I was broke. I was hungry. I ate at the food banks. My mind went crazy. The loneliness, the fear, the paranoia, the guilt, the shame. You know, they have a saying in recovery rooms, don't have to take the garbage truck to the dump. Well, I was well on my way to the dump. I was abusive to my mother. I'd steal from my mother in active alcoholism. I wasn't very nice to people what's at all. I was a loner. I was a drifter. I didn't go to the dentist. I didn't go to the doctors. I didn't do anything for myself, but drink myself into oblivion and think that was okay. Knowing when I was 18 years old, my own brother-in-law told me I had a drinking problem. I continued to drink. Alcohol use disorder does not have to look like what I just described to you. There was, it started off good, but then it took over my life. It ruined my life. Alcoholism or alcohol use disorder has a great, a great capacity, a great tool or a great way to take away everything that you hold precious in your life. I had a beautiful record collection, LPs, you know, like 350 albums. You know, I had Rod Stewart albums. I had Pink Floyd albums, I had Black Sabbath, Nazareth, uh, ACDC, Led Zeppelins, beautiful albums, all in mint condition. I was willing to give that up because of the booze. I never paid my rent, the landlord kept them. I like almost collector items, I always thought. I had a Hell's Bells album and Highway to Hell album that I just cherished. I lost that because of my alcoholism. I lost automobiles all kinds of money because of fines, fighting, going to jail, all kinds of destruction in my life. My health was deteriorating, 
heart palpitations, bowel problems, I've talked about in other videos, all sort of things that I was willing to do. But if somebody ever came up to me and said, do you know, Terry, you should give recovery a chance. You're an alcoholic, maybe you should try something. Oh no, 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 it was like the cross to Dracula, like holy water, you know, to Dracula. I wouldn't do it, I would not do it. And I don't think anybody watching this video set out to be an alcoholic or set out to have addiction issues. That wasn't in the cards, that wasn't in my cards. And I know it's not in your cards. So give yourself an opportunity to live a life of fulfillment, of happiness, security, and joy, and dreams, and hope. Give yourself that opportunity by quitting alcohol and drugs one day at a time. Give yourself the opportunity. I'm not trying to scare you into recovery. You have to make that decision on your own. This is a list of the things I did, and I can add to this list. I could go on and on, blackouts, you know, going home, having people in my car and wondering how I got home. And my car would be crooked in the, in the ditch, fighting with cops, just crazy, crazy, crazy things. I lived in six different places my last year of drinking. My last year of drinking, I had about seven jobs, eight jobs. I couldn't hold a job. I could not do it. I was too angry. I was too anxious all the time. I had problems. But recovery is possible even for a guy like me. And that's what I'm trying to share on this channel, Alcohol Free Life. Recovery is possible one day at a time. It really is, okay? If you like my video, please leave a comment below. If you don't like my video, leave a comment below. But can you all do me one favor? Can you please subscribe to my channel? I really appreciate it. My name is Terry G. This is an Alcohol Free Life channel where we learn to live sober one day at a time. Thanks a lot for stopping by. And remember, we're in this together. Together, we can, we can get sober. Together, we can great, get a great recovery, okay? God bless you. One day at a time. Ciao for now. Bye-bye.